Hello, this is Ashley Playmaster. Welcome to uh, another face video or vlog, whatever. Alright, so welcome to the Mario Kart, Mario Kart 8 Tricks and Tips. If you are an old timer to my channel, eh, my channel's not that old, but, <clears throat> but my channel, you've probably seen more and more Mario Kart 8 a lot more often. One, because I just got online not too long ago and I want to record some more. And two, I just love the game. So, I'm not sure if all of you know how to play Mario Kart, but the majority watching this video do. So, if you know how to play Mario Kart and know everything about it, this video is probably not for you. This is for any new people to Mario Kart, or just get the game, or and struggling, whatever. So, I'm going to talk about the Wii U version and the Wii version. Because I have a normal Wii that was before I got the Wii U. And, uh, yeah. So, first trick. You shoot them in the face. No, just kidding. You don't have blasters. So. So, what, let's just start first. So, one. So, if you're playing Mario Kart. And this is all about with the power ups. We talk about the Wii U Mario Kart 8 version first. If you get a green shell in the power up, it's all about timing. You want to throw it, leading your shot if you're on a turn, and you want to line up. I may or may not be showing some clips. Maybe I don't know. So if I don't, don't be surprised if I do. I might. So you want to line up your shot when you have a green shell, or if you hold B for the Wii, just for the normal Wii version, hold B, it'll pop up behind you. That way, if someone fires a red shell, it'll just, it'll destroy each other, but won't hit you. So, it'll be pretty much fine. That's the same with, ban with banana peels as well. Hold them behind you, and you're just coasting along, and you're clear. You're clear unless a blue shell hits you or anything. So, another thing... Is that in Mario Kart 8, you have a boomerang. If you, and it, uh, pff, can't speak today. The, pff, can't speak today. If you see my latest video, my latest video on Mario Kart, one, a scene where I'm driving along with a boomerang, I see a red show warning pop up on the, on the bottom part of the screen, and then I just throw the boomerang behind me, and it destroys it, and it destroys the boomerang as well. So that's another thing that you could do in Mario Kart 8. Another thing that I personally love to do that I could do in either version, Wii or Wii U, is if you have mushrooms, again, if you see one of my latest Mario Kart 8 videos, I believe it's the second to last, I don't know, whichever one. So, if, and, I, and it's not cheating technically, because, you know, it's not cheating, it's available, it's right there. If there is a turn, if you have mushrooms and if there's room, you could just cut across the grass instead of taking the road. That's what I like to do. Technically, again, it's not cheating. Because it's right there, it's available to you. Like I did in Twisted Mansion, if you've seen one of my videos. I So the finish line's right here. Turning point's right here. I cut across the grass right to the finish line. Again, not cheating. It's right there. I'm just using what I have, not cheating. And I'm not hacking either. So, and also another thing, another cool thing that not many people might know if you're new to the game, if you get a bullet bill, it automatically controls you through the course. So, you could just put on your controller, or wh whichever you have, and it'll just automatically do the turns and curves, loop to loops for you. Oh yeah, and, uh, and also another power-up, you get a piranha plant that pops in front of this car, and it jumps your way forward and forward. And if you get close enough to another person driving it, it'll jump their cart or any incoming mushrooms except for the blue shell. So, uh, yeah. So it's mainly just deflecting or destroying any shells, mainly that kind of stuff. Oh, yeah, and the star, you guys can probably know what the star does. It gives you invisibility powers for about 10 seconds. So. Oh, yeah, and also, 
another thing Mario Kart 8 that's on on normal Wii version is that in some courses your wheels turn sideways. So what that means if you see your wheels turning sideways and if you see a pole with about I don't say blue particles, circular pole around the blue particles or other place, you want to bounce into them because that way you'll turn and get a speed boost. Also the ten coins will be helpful as well. I was get a speed boost as well. So yeah, that, that's another thing in Mario Kart 8. Um, can't think of any other ones. Yeah, yeah, so... Yeah, I think I got all the ones Mario Kart 8. Tell me in the comments if I missed any. Um, alright, so now for the Wii version, for just a normal Wii, which I bet everyone has Wii, but just in case you have a Wii still. So Mario Kart, just normal Wii Mar Mar Mario Kart. There are different power-ups. There's also a POW power-up, and when you POW, you pretty much think, oh, I'm going to get flat on your dunes. But thanks to a friend that I learned a couple months ago, if you shake your Wii remote, when a POW is about to hit you, if you just keep shaking it, you'll get slowed down, yes, but you won't get flattened. Try that. And also, another cool thing is, in Mario, in normal Mario Kart, you can get um, a big mushroom, which will instantly make you bigger. And if you experienced it, if lightning hits you, it'll just turn you back to a normal size. Yeah, so cool, right? And also, the bullet bills work the same. It'll automatically take the course for you. Ups and downs, loop de loops, whatever. And in normal Mario Kart, you cannot have, you don't have any flipped over weird wheels. So, yeah, you don't need to worry about that. And also, in both games, if you're going on the speed boost and you're jumping, shake your controller or if you're on the Wii U version, and you have control by analog sticks, just press a button. I forget which button. I don't exactly remember which button it is, but you'll do a trick. As soon as you land, you get a speed boost. So, yeah, that's pretty much all you, all you really have to know. Yeah, since I, I haven't uploaded in a little while, and I want to upload a video very soon. So, well, thank you guys for watching. Tell me in the comments if you found this useful. And have fun in Mario Kart if you're about to play right after this video is uploaded. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to my channel if you're new. Like this video if you enjoy it. I'll see you all later. Bye!